Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. It's me Rabia and today I'm going to be designing some title headings uh, for my bullet journal. Uh, so let's get started. So I'm just gonna write title lettering on the top. and make a colorful box around it mm. perfect and I'm just gonna add some sparkles because I am obsessed with sparkles You guys would have probably noticed that by now. So, done. Uh, let's start with the main title designs. So for the first one, I'm gonna make a pretty simple one that everyone has probably used nowadays. So you make a box and you write anything that you want to write inside and you take a marker and from this side and at the bottom you just make a thick line uh, with the black liner you just add some lines And you have a pretty cute header for your bullet journal. On the next one, this is going to be another pretty plain one, but still super cute if you're going for a minimalistic look. So first you make a square. Your square does not need to be perfect because it will be representing a piece of paper. And then you write the text inside and you color it in with any color you like for the next one it's another pretty plain one you write title with the starting wave and end wave being a little curly and then you add this little lines and with a marker you redraw them again perfect on the next one this is going to be pretty cool so you make a banner over here Go to the next area, right over here, and then you make little flaps. And write your text in it. And once again, you can color these up. Any colors you like, or in any pattern or color scheme you like. I'm just gonna make this a little bit more bigger. Okay, perfect. Going to the next one. The next one I used a lot in my previous journal for my 2021, my 2020s bullet journal. You write the title and you make these lines again. Let's go with 
this. For the next one, I'm gonna be writing Taicho uh, with a marker. I'm just gonna add in some random lines. Making them thick. And you have another title. Creating titles is super easy. Especially when you know, especially when you have a theme in mind. For the next one, I'm gonna write title again. With separate and with joining writing, uh, cursor writing, I'm gonna write title on top of it. There you go. For the next one, I'm going. To, I'm thinking to do it in a more minimalistic style. So you make write T, and by the bottom line, you add a double line, just like this. I did recently use this in a video. Um, I don't even remember which video it was. <laughs> and then you fill in any color you like. There you go. What's the next one? Next one is another plain one. Let's just stay over here. We're going for a minimalistic title looks. Is there a title in plain writing, but you leave a little gap over here. And then with the marker, you do this. I'm drawing it a little bit curly. It can be straight too. It's similar to this one. Now let's try a little bit different. So I'm gonna write title. And make this curvy with a marker. I'm gonna add these. I'm going to just kind of scribble some marker lines. Then with a different marker, I'm going to cover the rest. Perfect. I didn't use headers that often, but seems like they're pretty cool. <laughs> And to make sure that I don't make any mistakes, I'm going to take a pencil and I'm going to write title. And then I'm going to copy, I'm going to erase the middle part. <laughs> That is between right here. And then I'm gonna crease it up. Just like this. erase the whole thing. And 
and once again with a marker, you go over So I'm going to go with a few more. Making hearts in between each letter. And then filling it in with different colors. So I'm going to color the heart pink. And outline each letter with orange. There you go. So I think I can do one more and that'll be it. So I'm gonna make a box. I always mess up the top lines. Once again, coloring these in and done. And once again, who can forget sparkles on a page? So first I'm adding these tiny dots all over the page and later I'm going to make sparkles. Time for the sparkles. And you have a beautiful page. So I think that's it for this video. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye.